uh, Madam Chair, at those, but I look forward to, to more contributions. I'll call the Honourable Damien O'Connor. Thank you very much, Madam Chair. And, and I can't add much by way of uh, wisdom around the detail of this piece of legislation uh, that goes beyond that of, of the member who's put this up. And I'd just like to acknowledge um, her vision, I guess, um, and bring this bill into Parliament, into the previous Parliament, um, and seeing, obviously, uh, the need to change a uh, piece of legislation that has been around f since 1973. Much has changed uh, in those um, following years, uh, Madam Chair, and I think that um, um, Ruth Dyson did, uh, has done New Zealand uh, proud to bring this legislation before the House and to point out some of the, uh, I guess, anomalies that run through a lot of um, uh, payments, particularly for elderly people um, across New Zealand. And uh, I guess the, the advent of these, um, I guess, this new form of uh, um, retirement village um, and is one that we need to look at more carefully. There'll be growth in this area. We have to ensure that, that people moving into these villages have the same fair go and access to support, necessary support, I have to say, uh, as everyone else. The reality is, um, and it's been pointed out in the recent water report, that across the country, local government um, has, has run down um, or let run down its infrastructure and pressure will come on ratepayers, regardless of who they are, into the future. Um, we have retirees in New Zealand who have traditionally had a reasonable income and a reasonable standard of living, thanks to a superannuation scheme um, that has been supported over the years and boosted at times um, by both governments, I have to say, although um, safeguarded, I guess, more by Labor over the years. The fact is that there will be pressure on all ratepayers, and if we are to follow through with a rates rebate scheme, which this Labor government is committed to, we want to ensure, ensure that it goes to everyone fairly. And so this piece of legislation from the member um, does allow that to happen. Um, I acknowledge her efforts, uh, applaud her determination to keep this moving, um, and not going to hold up the House for too much longer, uh, other than to say that uh, it's a pleasure to work with someone who came into this House in the same year as I did, 1993, um, and that we still have much to offer Parliament. Um, and this piece of legislation will be appreciated by thousands and thousands of people into the future who just want a fair go in their retirement. I call the Honourable Penny Henari. Chair, thank you for this opportunity.